Hello everybody, Zach here and welcome back to another GTA 5 Chase Me. We're going to be back with the Fast and Furious cars. Today we're going to be using the 1995 Mitsubishi Eclipse. This is an Eclipse GS. This was used by uh, Brian, Brian O'Connor in preparation for the first race, I believe. So it was not in a lot of the movie, but still a very known car because of the movie, nonetheless. And I just love this pack. This pack is fantastic. If you want to download this pack, it will be in the description like most of the mods that I use in GTA 5. So, without further ado, let's go into player options like I've done this before. And, uh, for one at level to two. And that's gonna be our first challenge today. We are going to attempt to avoid a two-star wanted level. If you haven't been here for a chase me before, that's basically what we do. We up the ante each time. Uh, we try to head into the military base in almost every episode. I would say it's a newer thing. Uh, I didn't always try to do it in the old Chase Me's. We're going to see if we can even get found by the cops with our first two stars. If not, we'll go up to three. Hope you're having a great day wherever this video finds you and dead. All right, that would have not been good in real life. It would have definitely been uh, our front end would be damaged. Okay, we've got the Los Santos PD here. So let's get the hell out of here. Probably shouldn't hop right on the highway. You know what? We're not going to, actually. We're not going to hop right on the highway. We are going to stay in the city and see if we can avoid him in the city. So maybe that'll be the thing. Two or three stars in the city. What are you doing over here? Are you confused by me flipping around? I guess. I guess that would make sense. I was confused by myself flipping around, so. And we're not going to repair today. That will be our uh, that will be our other challenge. We are not going to repair today, so put that on there too. If we repair, challenge loss. Tuh. I don't know why I. Oh my god! I gotta drive a little bit more cautiously if I'm not going to repair. Yeah, this Enspeak uh, car or car pack is great. I think I got the first one or the second one, so. There's definitely newer ones that have more cars in them. Like ha one has the Civics and uh, some other cars from, from more of the movies. So I'm definitely probably going to check that out in the future if you guys want me to. And heck, we might even do a mod showcase uh, one time on like all of the cars. Because I think it's they're pretty deserving and they work with the, the latest game, even though a bunch of these came out a while ago. Because that's the problem, actually, too. Sometimes old mods do not continue to work. Uh, as GTA 5 gets updated. Oh. Oh, wow. That was a close one. Okay. We're doing fine, though. You know, all things considered, we're doing fine. Only our self sustained damage there. Or self create. Whatever. You know what I meant. Yeah, we still got two stars. Oh, my God. Another close one. <laughs> I think we're gonna lose him here. Hey, what's going on, brother? We're going in here. How's it going? Oh, no. We're just gonna wait a second, see if we lose him. I hear sirens. Don't see anybody. Yep, we lost him. Cool. That was pretty easy. Challenge number one complete. Let's hop it up to three. And this is when they get, you know, a little bit more aggressive, obviously. But we're gonna, I think cars like this are actually perfect for this because we've got good, you know, bottom end acceleration. We can go through alleyways. We can kind of, if, if we can drive well, we can kind of sneak through areas that make it a little bit more difficult for the, for the AI. Go by the vanilla unicorn here. Oh! I say, yeah, that the driving skill is what's required here to make this... <laughs> to make this go well, right? I said that, right? And we got a lot of cops now. Yeah, this thing's quick, though. And we got helicopters, and they're shooting at us. Not good. Not good at all. Oh. 
I'm trying to think of where else we haven't really gone, but we've gone... I feel like in almost every chase me, we've gone through the entire map. I mean, that being said, we're not usually in the city as much, so I'm trying to make that more of a thing because I think some of the city is kind of set up perfectly to, like I said, lose them. You probably got alleyways that I've never been down. I actually believe that might be the case or that I haven't been down as often. This is not really an alleyway. Oh, there's a little alleyway down here. This is not a place where cars can go. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. This is not good. Oh, there we go. We got enough. <laughs> okay, all right. So alleyways might not have been the best decision here. Definitely if I don't know where they go. And they don't go anywhere. Spoilers. Oh, right by the police station. Probably not the smartest idea. Oh, it was bound to happen. Bound to happen that a close call would turn into a... St stop it. I'll go through the movie. The movie studio here. Oh, hit both of the security guards through there. Oh, I was hoping to just spin into a cool move there, but... We're going to go through, through here, because we... I don't think we usually do. <gasps> oh my god, right over... We went right over two cars. Flip it. Flip it, baby. Flip it. Go, 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 go. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that was, that was close. You Prius. Dad. Prius driver's dad. Rightfully so. Okay. We're flashing. Flashing slash blinking. Oh yeah, he was just sitting there not even with the sirens on or anything. Alright, we're gonna go up this way and try to avoid this roadblock. on. Yeah, thank God I, uh, I'm wearing a seatbelt, right? <laughs> this... The Eclipse has held up really well, to be honest. Look at it. It's a champ. Its front end is pretty messed up, too. I guess I'm just not used to front wheel. This is the front wheel, right? Right? Yeah, this is front wheel. Oh, Sheriff, coming around the bend. Coyote, watch out. We never even went into the... Oh, this interior is awesome. Oh, look at it. It is right like from the movie. Oh. Yeah, I give a lot of credit. The, the interiors and then... Oh, nice try, Bob Saget. Go down here and hop onto the highway and head towards Fort San Cudo. I don't know that we're gonna lose three before we, ooh. I don't know that we're gonna lose three before we um, get the Force Hand Likely we're not going to. Somebody in one of my other videos, uh, sorry, I do not know the commenter's name, but they said, try a floor is lava, but you know, instead of the road being lava, the, oh, the um, off road being lava. And I was like, for me, that is a challenge. <laughs> So we should try that in a future episode. Oh, that biker, that biker's going in oncoming lanes. Oh, Dundry, idiot. What is traffic doing? Do you see this guy? Do you see this biker in oncoming lanes? I, I don't even know what, what's going on back there. Sheriff's gonna pull some stupid crap. We're gonna go to the right of this roadblock. Oh, 
Oh no, you didn't. Luckily for them. Oh my god. I also love that the, uh, that works too. The RPM on the, uh, oh, does it have a shift light too? Uh, I guess it was just a reflection or, oh, no, it does. It has a shift light. Holy crap, the detail. It's awesome. All right. We have not repaired or anything. We are headed into Fort Tancudo. This thing should have no problem getting into Fort Tancudo. As long as the sheriff doesn't mess it up. He's not going to. Yes. Nice. Oh, wow. Uh, oh, landing was not as smooth as I wanted it to be, but we're in Fort Tancudo, everybody. Fort Tancudo escape, though, maybe? Oh, come on. I think we're going to... I think we're going to Fort Tancudo escape in this, uh, in this. This is like 50-50 chance of working. Get in. Get in. This is taking way too long to get into. Let's hope we don't get shot. Oh, I hear explosions. I hear stuff shooting at us. Tank. Tank. Oh, that's right. Oh, no. We're dead. <gasps> we avoided it. We avoided the lock on. We did not avoid that lock on. Oh, shoot. We're ejecting. I don't know how we survived, but we are not in a good spot. <laughs> I hear explosions going off in the distance. So what do we got now? We failed the three star because we didn't lose three stars. We've got four from the military base. Uh, we successfully exited Fort Sankudo, arguably. And uh, oh, no, we've got mil uh, that was either military or SWAT coming down the left side. I just hear explosions constantly going off. I don't know what that's about. Why are, why are there just expl? You hear that? And we're just trying. I'm just trying to run up here and get into a vehicle. I don't know that that's going to be ho be possible. Oh, run, Zach, run! Oh, yeah, I heard there's the bastard, everybody. Oh no, he's shooting at us. Oh no, this is what's coming my way. It's going to be what I get into. <laughs> Stop the truck. Get in here. I need to get in the jack. The gas best for less. <laughs> get in. Get in. Get in. Dead. Okay, so three stars failed, arguably. Ah, well, it was. Four stars failed. Then kudo, successful exit of the base. Not a successful loss of four stars. But that's going to do it for today's Chase Me. If you like this pack, if you want to see more of the Fast and the Furious cars, really appreciate it if you like the video and subscribe to the channel. Uh, it'll really help me out and let me know what you guys like and what you want to see in the future. If you want to come over to the Patreon, I would really appreciate if you could support the channel. Uh, you can do dollar tier and above, gets early access to videos like this one. And uh, also there's your YouTube membership too, which has a join button as well. So I would really appreciate it. All of those people that are Patreon uh, supporters, you know, the pledge as well as YouTube supporters, you really help me out and you're making all of this content possible and i really do appreciate it i hope you have a great rest of the day or week and go ahead and put chimichangas in the chat i say chat but the comments and uh, i'll let you know you're a real i'll let you know you'll let me know that you're a full-time viewer i don't know what that means but i hope you guys enjoyed the video again and i'll see you in the next one bye